Debbie Moore? Yes, sir. I'm Debbie Moore from Arlington, Texas, and I serve as the chapter leader of Start School Later Texas, as well as the chapter director of the national nonprofit Start School Later. Strategies to promote a healthy school culture must examine the very hours that we expect our teens to attend school daily. 25 years of peer-reviewed adolescent sleep research indicates teens need about nine hours of sleep and experience a delayed body clock at puberty. Most teens cannot fall asleep before 11 p.m. Nine out of 10 teens are sleep deprived. Each hour of lost sleep is associated with a 38% increase in the risk of feeling sad or hopeless and a 58% increase in suicide attempts. High school seniors are three times more likely to have a strong symptoms of depression if they have excessive daytime sleepiness. The CDC says teen sleep deprivation is a public health crisis. Numerous health and education groups are recommending middle and high schools start the day at 8.30 or later, including the American Academy of Pediatrics, the American Psychological Association, and the Texas School Health Advisory Committee. In Texas, 12% of school districts are following these recommendations, but we need your help to get the other 88% to these minimum start times. Legislative perimeters are needed to provide the framework for districts, similar to the perimeters the state sets for the beginning of the academic year and the number of minutes in a year. Later high school start times will add $3.3 billion to the Texas economy in 10 years through higher academic performance and reduced teen car crashes. The most effective prevention strategy to improve the school environment addresses the very foundation of a student's well-being, sleep. Middle and high school start times after 8.30 a.m. are a basic part of the healthy school culture. Thank you. All right, thank you. Who did you say was the 